common training mistakes, not putting the time in with yours. Now, you'll hear me say this, you don't need to school a horse over and over again for hours and hours, kind of the old school way of doing things, you know, putting the wet saddle blankets on them and running them till they're ragged and tired. But you have to make the commitment to set aside some time for them. It doesn't have to be a lot of time, but it's important that you set aside the time that you've designated for your horse and that it's enough time that you can get through the lesson and not feel like you're being rushed or kind of impatient with your horse. So, uh, for example, you know, uh, somebody asked me, you know, I only got 20 minutes to work with my horse and my horse isn't really getting anything. Set aside more time. That's all there is to it. We don't want to pigeonhole our horse into having them to do everything we want them to do in 20 minutes. That might not be enough time at this time with your horse. Down the road, you might be able to spend, you know, just 15 or 10 minutes training your horse. But right now, if your horse is struggling, set aside an hour. Your horse is going to do so much better if you set aside one hour a month, let's say, as opposed to just 20 minutes, you know, three times a week. But those sessions aren't productive. Remember, just like with a lot of things in life, it's quality over quantity, but you got to make sure that you set aside that time to begin with so that you're able to make sure that it's a quality, meaningful, and effective session that you're having with your horse.